Doctype is a tag that when you're trying to learn HTML can be difficult for you to understand why you need it. It doesn't appear in the rendered file, you can't style it, and basically if you're a user of the website, you'll never notice it's there unless you jump into the code. So why is it a requirement of HTML5 to have a Doctype tag? Because if we run an HTML file without it, markup still appears. If we get the page to work without Doctype, why do we need it at all? Well, of course, there's a reason for everything you do in programming, and Doctype does serve a role. The Doctype, as according to MDM, in HTML, the Doctype is a required preamble found at the top of all documents. Its sole purpose is to prevent the browser from switching into the so-called quirks mode when rendering a document. Quirks mode exists because when first browsers came out, there was only really two major ones that people used, Netscape and Internet Explorer. This was before web standards were really a thing, and sites were only coded to work within the confines of those two browsers. Then, when the W3C was formed and web standards established, not all websites could adopt the new standard at once, potentially making a great many websites at the time unreachable. So Quirks Mode puts the browser into a setting where it interprets HTML as Netscape would have back in 1994. This means your browser can still display websites that were created over 20 years ago as they were meant to be viewed, for better or worse. When Doctype is used, you can tell the browser to use specific modes that are used to display HTML, XML, or older standards of HTML, Internet Explorer, and others. However, in the vast majority of places, the first HTML tag in our files will always be Doctype HTML. So we can use the HTML5 syntax. Well, that's all I have about Doctype. If you learned something new today, please hit that like button. And if you're interested in learning more about web development or just web programming in general, hit the subscribe button. I'll have new content coming out on a weekly basis. Thanks very much for watching, and we'll see you next time.